Down on South Korea's west coast in Semangam, the 2023 World Scout Jamboree is well underway. The opening ceremony took the center stage on day two of the 12-day event. Our Choi soo Hyung's at the Jamboree campground. The 25th Royal Scout Jamboree entered its second day in Semangam on Wednesday with a variety of programs for scouts to enjoy, as well as the event's official opening ceremony. Despite the long distance traveled and record breaking hit in Korea, the scouts persevered and showed their resilience. I became a scout because uh, my family and my sister um, told tell me that a uh, scout is a very beautiful place to be. It's a very sensational experience. So this is the place where scouts actually stay. Here, children set up tents and prepare next programs. The teenage scouts also share the experiences of setting up the tents themselves on the first day and how they felt during the process. I put it all together like at 10 p.m. so it was kind of difficult because of the, the light, the light, it was, it was night. But it was, it was really cool, it was really cool and everything was perfectly fine. And... Former UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon was also there to attend the opening ceremony of the Ban Ki-moon village, close to the Jamboree campsite and named in honor of the former UN chief, where eco-friendly lectures and discussions were held to commemorate the Jamboree. Additionally, the last cyclodes team from France arrived at Semangam after an impressive 14,000 kilometers bicycle journey from Paris to promote eco-friendly practices as well and deliver messages of hope to the young scouts. So uh, the theme of the Jamboree is here is draw your dream and uh, our dream was to make this big challenge to go from a part of the world to the other part. We crossed half of the world I think to come here and uh, it was uh, such an adventure, such an exploration and uh, we want to say to the scouts in the Jamboree, be explorers and uh, have big dream. At 8 p.m. The opening ceremony started with an enthusiastic live performance by the Dream Orchestra composed of Korean scout members. Survivor expert Bear Grylls and K-pop artists also celebrate the event and thrilling fireworks greeted scouts from around the world at Semangum. President Yoon seok yeol of South Korea, himself a former scout member, welcomed scouts with a paper airplane flying performance. But amid the positive vibes, there were some safety concerns as some 480 people at the event were treated for heat related illness on Tuesday and Wednesday. The Jamboree continues until August 12th. Chesu Hyang, Arirang News, Semangun.